Bonjour, welcome back. Je m'appelle Herman, my name is Herman. Today's French grammar lesson was going to be actually a vocabulary lesson, une leçon de vocabulaire, but which will also include some elements of grammar. And we are going to describe someone's eyes in French. As strange as it may sound, we are going to do just that, describing someone's eyes. As you know, we encounter people every day, new people, friends, etc. And it's always a good idea to know how to describe their faces in French, in a different language. In this way, you will be able to learn more vocabularies and know how to uh, write sentences describing someone's uh, eye colors or nose length or mouth or uh, hair length, etc., etc. So this uh, particular chapter will be about describing someone's general appearance. And we'll begin with the description of eyes. Now, I have a couple of sentences here for you. Jen a les yeux marron. Again, Jen a les yeux marron, which means Jen has brown eyes. Jen a les yeux marron. And the next one is Il a les yeux bleus. Il a les yeux bleus. So we're describing the color of the eyes here. And as you can see, marron means brown and bleu means blue. And eyes, les yeux. Jen a les yeux marron. Il a les yeux bleus. He has blue eyes. Now, how do we do that? Well, we have a very simple formula to describe someone's eyes. Well, when you do that, you just simply use the verb avoir, which means to have, avoir, which you conjugate in any tense of your choice, uh, present usually. But if you wish to say that, oh, someone had blue eyes, etc., well, you can use the past tense. I don't know why you would do that, but <laughs> you could always use any tense, verb tense of your choice. But usually, the présent simple, the simple present, will do just fine. So, avoir followed by les yeux, which means eyes, and the color. So this is when we want to focus on the eye color, right? So avoir les yeux, avoir les yeux bleus, to have blue eyes. Avoir les yeux bleus. Avoir les yeux marron, to have brown eyes. Now, something to, pin, to, 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 to point out. We have here marron, which means brown. We have here bleu. We have vert, which means green. What do you notice at the end of each color uh, names? Well, we see that bleu has an S, vert has an S, noir and gris have an S. Except for marron. Marron doesn't have any S's. Why? Because in French, marron, the color marron remains invariable. It will not change. You do not place any S to marron even in the plural form, like here, les yeux, the eyes. Marron is uh, invariable. It will not change its form in the plural form. Okay, so avoir les yeux bleus, avoir les yeux marron, avoir les yeux verts, avoir les yeux noirs, avoir les yeux gris. Now let's take, uh, let's write a few examples here. So what if I wanted to say, she has green eyes. So elle, she, elle a, Les yeux, she has eyes, literally, she, she has the eyes, elle a les yeux verts, she has green eyes. What if I want to say, I have brown eyes, which I do, j'ai les yeux marron, I have brown eyes, and do not put any S at the end of marron, I have brown eyes. What if I wanted to say that Chris has gray eyes? Chris has gray eyes. I would say Chris a les yeux gris. Chris a les yeux gris. Okay? So that's the formula. Avoir followed by les yeux and the eye color. And you will usually put an S except for marron. Marron is a color that doesn't take any S in the plural form. Uh, as well as orange. Orange. Orange doesn't also take any uh, S. All right, so let's move on to the next one. We have a few more examples. Léa a les yeux gris. Léa has gray eyes. Léa a les yeux gris. Chris a les yeux verts. Chris has green eyes. 
Ben a les yeux marron, Ben has brown eyes. So go ahead and come up with a few random names, friends, uh, family members, and write in French the color of their eyes. And that will be a great exercise that you can uh, post in the French lab. For example, uh, mon père a les yeux, my father has, you know, whatever eye color. Ma mère a les yeux, ma tante a les yeux, my aunt has Uh, blue eyes, uh, my friend Carla has brown eyes, etc. And write it in French. And this way you can practice not even not only your, your the spelling, of, but also practice the structure. Avoir les yeux followed by the color, which was the formula here. Avoir les yeux plus color. Okay, so we have a quiz to end this very short lesson. Uh, I would like you to describe the eye colors of three or four celebrities. Right. So come up with a description of uh, three celebrities of your choice. For example, uh, Brad Pitt. Uh, J'aime bien Brad Pitt. Uh, I like Brad Pitt very much. So come up with uh, three random uh, celebrities and describe their eye colors. And uh, write it down and post your answers in the French lab. Okay. Merci et à très bientôt. It could be celebrities or personalities or person that you know, etc. Or just come up with any magical being and oh uh, this sorcerer had you know some fiery green eyes whatever but just use the uh, formula avoir plus les yeux which was written here avoir plus les yeux plus color so that's it for now merci et à très bientôt au revoir bye bye